Hello my friends and welcome back to Dontropolis, the city named by Scouse Mouse for this series. This is episode 2, I'm recording this just after episode 1. I think I've got the quality issues just about down. Uh, I've reduced graphical settings as you can see, you know, not the best right now. But, it sort of, if it helps it not lag, then hopefully that's good for you. Um, so I've got the graphic settings as low as I can possibly hold them to try and help make that work. Uh, usually I play on the highest settings with my computer, but obviously while recording it's just too much for it, I think. Episode 1 was at a level where I was like, it's probably just about watchable, so I can probably start up in the graphics again after this episode. But I wanted to see what the difference was. Already again, over coding, over encoding overloaded warnings. So hopefully you guys, it's not too bad. What we're going to do though, first thing we're going to do is we're going to delete some of these power lines because we really don't need them. And if we look at our gridding and our electricity, oh that's actually a nightmare because I've now siphoned electricity away from most of my city. Let's just keep demolishing then and we will come back and go to electric and oh no we've not because we can actually go all the way back here and it's going to be fine. So we've actually just got a bit more money in the kitty just by demolishing some power lines that we didn't really need. And we've hit this 750 which means we get a new area, district's policy, a second loan, district specialisation, service policy, the fire department, police department, a unique building, forestry and architecture, agriculture specialisation for industry, power usage policies, water usage, a smoke detector distribution, firehouse and a police station so straight away we can get a new area what I want to do first though is just pause and click and have a look at natural resources so as you see this is fertile land fertile land fertile land little bits of fertile land here as well uh, we've got no oil on this map we've got some forestry up here and around here it's not a whole lot. Uh, we've got no ore that I can see. Maybe a little bit here, actually, but either way, it's not really there. So what I think we're going to do is we're going to buy this bit of plop of land here rather than this one. And then we can start building our industrial zone on the other side of the main state or the main highway. and have it here and exp expand it eventually to here um, I think what's this line for? that's got to be a line for something no idea what it's for but it's for something um, so let's do that I think obviously it's strongest here so we could actually go on this side but again right now if we go on this side not got a bridge across here yet so workers would have to go out of the district to come back in to work so I'm thinking we go for this side just now and it's got foreign resources and it's got forestry resources but there's this one's no it's got no oil either so the ore must be here no we've got no oil on this so let's purchase here so we own this tile now, we can come back in and what we can do is we can start going to here and we, I want to just keep this map up just now um, road I've not got intersections yet, that's annoying ok, so what we're going to do just now is we're going to put a double lane coming in here, coming down to about here and then we're just going to hit page up, come across to here, page down and that will again be a short term solution to a potential long term problem and we're going to start just building a lot of roads here Um, again, just keep this on. 
and we're just going to bring it in like so. We'll just go round like so. And keep going round because, you know, why not really? Seems to be the best way to get the most out of this. And it would look slightly different in honesty. And then I just want to bring back to here and go out like so and up like so. So this will be our whole new resident uh, industrial area in this bit here and be our first district really so then what I want to do is district okay industrialized specializations for farming industry forestry okay it's not letting me do anything with this. Raise district, paint district. Okay, so it's not letting us do that just now. So what I want to do is just quickly just go to this and dezone. And I want to dezone everything that's here. No, let's not do that. Go with everything that's here. And I want to just bring our residential across to here, uh, industrial to here rather. And I'm just going to go again, just go keep misclicking this. So we'll go to like so, and we'll just fill the rest in really. Bonk, dunk, dunk, dink, 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 and dink. Let's have a look at this grid again. I want to just clear you off. And I want to clear maybe you off, put some commercial in here. And we'll do the same here. I'll put some commercial in here. And then now are you going to let me do? Why are you not letting me? Do you? Okay. A bit unsure. Do I district it maybe? It's not letting me district either. Play? Nope. Nope. Why are you not letting me do anything? This really hasn't worked, has it? Hopefully it will work. Um, what I actually want to do is just industrial and fill in that little bit there. Any other little bits that have been missed. Doesn't look like it just now. So this should all start to disappear. Um, what we need to do though is bring water from here up to here. We'll just go like so. And we're out of money. Uh oh. Uh oh. I've not thought this through, have I? Um, right. Pause, pause, pause. Economy loans. Give me a second loan, please. 20,000 or 60,000. <sighs> Gotta take the 60,000 because even though it's more interest, um, the payment plan is actually lower, so let's bring that out. So we've got 60,000 now, so thank you very much. We'll just bring you back out to here, like so. And we'll bring the water up and up. And again, just bring it back just a touch. One a very little overlap, but one overlap still. 
and if it's just a little bit and again just a little bit for here bring it back just a touch again done and again if you want anything named after you let me know in the comments down below and then what I need to do is get electricity coming up from here just coming across to let's bring it to here and then across to here like so and then hopefully that will build in sequence by itself landfill site we will open another one if I can find it garbage because you always want that in industrial areas bring it to here and I want to empty this once it's empty I can delete it and get my money back and remove all this from this side Just tell me I can have road names that's on you guys unlock the achievement foggy weather as well so we're still being profitable right now but obviously we've got no real money if you like to well we've got money but we've got no legitimate money to do anything with emptying finished which means we can now demolish this and that should now let us do that so is this yeah this is doing generic industry why I've got water here that's not connected that's why now that should in theory connect and keep them happy um, can I make this farmland yet why is this not letting me do anything ok so let's go with paint a district and then go with farming only yeah that's done I'm over exceeding the district area so what I want to do is just go into natural resources and just paint delete this generic industry no I want to delete the district that's not on the fertile land because that would also be bad for business so I'm spinning around instead of doing what I need to be doing Oh, I think I've just about got it. Should be all that inner circle that's fertile land. Actually, paint this district back out just a little bit. Because I've got that. Actually, bring it out to here as well. And to here. And that will be Concord Square which will be a nice farming district as you can see already getting some farms, Mary's livestock and whatnot. it will not be called Concord Square it will be renamed when you guys are ready and we've got the green uh, achievement so then what we need to do is we need to build a fire service so that's not the right one can we cover everything please? And we want police as well. So thank something like that is going to work and then we need more residential so let's go for that that 
and make this commercial and this this and keep it residential <clears throat> getting a good advisor help just now and that will hopefully keep this going nicely so we've got some farmland coming in some beautiful roads there um, what's your issue taxes too high okay so let's have a look at taxes let's bring you back down to say 13 percent you're in line with everyone else budget loans can I pay some of that back no, they should be able to pay the full whack by the looks of it. Um, so we need more money to do that. And right now we don't have money, so got a lot of tweets. Do we not have enough power supply, or am I just missing something? You're definitely in the power grid, so I'm going to say that we've just not got enough supply. Let's build another wind farm or wind turbine, rather, and hopefully that does the trick. Indeed, it does. So now you've not got enough water, you're maybe not exactly in the zone of either of these pipes. So let's just build you out, see if that does it. Does indeed. Uh, how is our sewage works looking? It's okay. New services. We have something in here. Oh, we can build the Statue of Liberty basically. And we can build the pa a panda sanctuary. Oriental Barrel Tower and Temple Complex. So, we've got buildings that we can build. We're making money, despite not really having anything. Right now, we've got a huge demand for residential. So, that was a bit more than I meant to. We'll put commercial in there. You know, it works. And we'll put residential in here as well. Tiny touch of commercial in here. See if that reduces this demand just a little bit what's our next milestone by the way um 1200 uh, which will be interested interesting rather when do we get to start touching the highways that's what i really need yeah there we go so highways come at 2200 so that's fine by me still got a demand for residential here though uh, despite these fittings, so we'll go dink, dink in there. Expand into this former land, if you like. So we've got pet ban, smoking ban. Uh, parks and recreation, subsidised youth. A uh, come on all, which I'm going to say is, oh, so we can get a stadium, I think, is what it's trying to tell me. Um, basketball court, Britannic Garden, Paradox, Quay, these are canals, uh, football, which is one of the things I'd like to do. So, can we build a stadium? For 200,000. We can build a stadium for 200,000 and it will cost us a lot of electricity as well. So we're nowhere near there. In honesty, I'd like to have a football stadium. It's one of the things I want to do. That's why I bought that DLC, of course. Uh, so, how's our zone? I'm looking at it. this side. We're looking good. We've got plenty of stuff left. You should be on my electricity grid, so why are you not getting enough? There we go, that's working. 
nicely. Um, again, I want to remap all this at some point, but I need to rehome all these people first uh, before I do that, or at least have a plan to do it. So once we get a lot more money, I will start remapping this. Alan residential somewhere else, ideally maybe here or somewhere. But I think I need to get this new highway sorted first so that I can just go bring these guys onto the highway rather than on everything them all the way through town to get to the bits that they need to. If I'm honest, uh, let's get some more residential built then. So we'll go with this bit here then between Middle Street and Hunter Street and I guess we go with this bit as well with a bit of commercial here and see if that makes a difference um, how are we doing for milestone where well, next one is a 2200 one isn't it? yes it is so or we could bring residential to this side of the city in the meantime which is always an option. I can get a nice bridge coming across here, which would be nice to actually get done now before we end this episode. So I want to do not a highway, a six is this four lanes, large roads, six lane road, six lane. And this is obviously a decorative tree. So what I want to do is just go out like show no it's not going to work because the power lines are there that's frustrating can we go under it and then into a bridge yes we can we have a bridge we have our first bridge people it's a nice looking suspension bridge we'll just bring that out like so in the meantime Got to please to God tell me I've not done it one way. That'd be embarrassing. Um, what we want to do is just bring you out from here into here. And again, I will bring you from there into here. And then if we go for this and we go where left hand traffic, if I remember correctly. So you should be coming this way. And I want to build this a bit more generically, or less generic rather. So I want to bring it down into like a roundabout complex here. So I think I think I think. Link, link, link. Okay, it's not a perfect roundabout by any stretch of the imagination, but you know what? It'll do. Go. Just. Right, whatever. So, I want to do that into there and you into here. And then from there, I can take say another four lane road which would go right across to here it's maybe not quite perfect do you know what it'll work really should use a bigger road for this roundabout and then I'll have my residential around this area I think not covering any natural resources we've got some more farmland here that's very very fertile actually and we've got some that's very good there. Complaints of electricity again, and you're in the thing. So I'm going to say that we need more of these. Let's just put a couple down. That should start to go, I guess. Yeah, that problem's starting to go now. Obviously, sharing their power with other people. So, uh, I don't know. 
Let me know what you guys think. Regards to where we should put the residential. So we've also got farmland here, farmland here, farmland here and here and here. Uh, in Concord Square's district, which looks a bit strange in shape, shall we say? Um, and we've got a bit here as well that we could use. Uh, but obviously, this is very, very good farmland. Do we really want to not be using that as well as that to make sure that we've got? Nice residential and commercial zones. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think down below. If you want names or districts or streets or districts, as I said, let me know down below as well. In the meantime, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll hopefully catch you all next time.